Uh, had many a great basketball game here in this arena over the years. And let's see if we're going to get another one. Well, right now, Brooks catches it down low, goes up for a two-handed jam. Uh, that's a player, if they can get going after the rest of the season, that would be a huge asset. The pass intended for Diop. Well, the best plays from the first quarter. How about these? Brooks, he's going to. So that just speaks to the level that he has. Team that's won it in Spain before. Here's Van Rossum knocking down a three. Also the former Belgium national team point guard who retired from the national team. A little step back variety. Another look at that. Quick pass down low to Hooker. Then he gets it to Brooks who tried to go up and dunk it. Had no luck. And this time though he gets it back. So two dunks for Naz Brooks. Get past the menace. Here's Gillet. Gets it to Diop. And he puts it up and in. Good ball movement. Lots of problems. It's taking it some time to settle. Uh, this is the part of the court that's been a, a problem. They've struggled to get stops against Brooks. And Vernizio. Oh, that could be trouble. It is. Gillet. Uh, but good work tapping it out. By Shark. Now Jefferson reigns a three, it's eight apiece. That the rest felt like it was before. He had taken that step. Here's Salumu, he's a scorer, drives in, and he does indeed score with that left hand. John Salumu. It's nice seeing Salumu back with the team. Here he is driving. Back with the team after five years away. He's been like a, a real journeyman the last several years, Salumu. Oh, down low to a kin. Salumu. Oh, little uh, dipsy do into the lane. Here's Ahmad. Here's Salumu. Oh, yeah, he's enjoying. Here's a drive. And Brooks, nobody boxing him out. By Shark gets his hands up and that time denies. Skip pass, Salumu. Jefferson puts it up just inside the stripe. A tough, tough return for uh, for Tyrus McGee so far. By Shark, oh, beautiful bounce pass, pencil on! The lead here at the beginning of the game. Pentalon with the latest. Eight point advantage, the biggest of the game for Ostend. And Jefferson comes over, tries to help out, but Brooks gets another easy bucket. The flush. And then here was Brooks. Pentalon. Basic. Puts on the deck. No look. Salumu. Goes off one foot, knocks it down. This is Salumu right at the... Brooks uh, coming in from the corner. Oh, my, gave up the layup and gets a three. Etu getting his first bucket. I thought my made a mistake. And good hustle down the court. And here's Bicek getting in and getting rejected by Lacan. Bicek going up and not in your house. Lacan, little runner and again no box out of Brooks. Up to Jefferson. Double comes. Bicek for three. Oh boy, how about that? The lead, making it to the play-in. Look at that beautiful follow-through. See if there's a little bit more bounce in the step of Sig coming out of that timeout. Hooker into the corner, and the three-pointer is good. That's a good sign. He's coaching. And Vernizzi. Hooker fades, knocks it down. Oh, dangerous pass. Found Rossum to deal. Jefferson 
Knock it down. Another three. Count it. Nice shot. Back outside. Bessie! And he takes it up to a 13-point advantage. Look at him. He makes the most of his... So the second half action is indeed underway. Quentin Hooker, Quentin Hooker rather dribbling in the game. Fires Brooks and just how they started the first half. Brooks goes up for another dunk. Those are two crucial departments. Really big. Uh, uh oh, but now they're leaving up some open looks and they are going to start falling, folks. Trust me, Inverniezi and Gillet somehow keeps it. They don't have much time. Salumu gets it up just in the nick of time. Are you kidding me? The veteran. Look at this. Just before the clock went out for three. And Bite Shark does a great job getting it back. They pass it around. Van Rossum steps into a three, and not for the first time. A team has passed up what looked like an open layup with the Salumu three-pointer. And now Van Rossum. Let's go, Austin. Cheers coming from the fans. Gillet for three. Well, all you can say is it's about time, knowing how hot that guy can get. Really feels like it. Part of the issue is tempo. The Sig really need to speed this game up. Here's McGee, finally. Scores in the lane. Salumu from the left corner. Oh, are you kidding me? And Quentin Hooker gets the three right back. Or maybe he wrapped his left arm around him. Oh, boy, that's McGee. Oh, no, excuse me, Booth finally driving in, getting some buckets. Booth gets it up. He's blocked. Gets it back, puts it up, and boy, they had any number of chances there. Here's Diop. Gets the mismatch. Goes up for the flush. As we see Diop going to work here. Hooker. And Renizzi. Again, six points separate these two teams. The Dante Gillet turns it into an alley oop. Terrific. And that was a great play as well by Gillet. Hooker going behind his back into the corner, gets it back, goes off one foot. Are you kidding me? What a play at the end of the quarter by Hooker. And he got it off in plenty of time. Two of 12 from the floor. Gillet for three. Knocks it down. And with this particular lineup on the court, if you're Bayshard to be guarding Brooks so far away from the basket, he needs to sag. Here he is switching. Hooker puts up a high arcing shot. How good has he been? Unbelievable. I'm out. How about the take from Ahmad? Well, you can't say enough about Bayshark's performance tonight. He has been tough. And another drive, second in a row from Ahmad. And you know that... Strasburg, Hooker, whips it to the corner. McGee. Boy, had the jumper. Now they get it. Hooker. And Hooker's just playing like an all-star tonight. He has been sensational. Taking over with his drives. Here he goes again. Look out. And another drive. This time he is denied. Took on a kin. And now Hooker. A little floater in the lane. Are you joking? And Jalei gives him an and one. He is feeling it. Look at this. He's got 22 points, and look at that, they answer by Sharks. 
really a huge upset. Might not even be an upset if us 10 win. We know, we've always known they can put together performances like this. But if they get it, boy, it would be huge. Meanwhile, going to the other end, McGee. The Jale, you can count it! Of their 23 rebounds coming on the offensive glass, and that was one of them, and that was the biggest. Hooker goes in, misses this time. McKinn with the rebound, puts it right back up and in. Now McGee picks up the dribble. Skip pass, dangerous. Hooker drives in, oh yes, and one! And Bayshard is gone. Precious seconds ticking off the clock. Van Rossum for three, and that was short. And again, another chance. Here comes McGee, drives in, and he gets the layup. Here goes Booth. Spins out to McGee, gets in, takes a shot, and there's the follow from Booth. 2.3 seconds remaining. 2.3 seconds. And he puts it up for midcourt. Oh, he almost went in. Jefferson. Right now for Strasbourg. This goes off the glass and almost. Ahmad. Back to his driving ways. And he is fouled. Number 44 does it again. But one thing, yeah, surely not. Jefferson this time drives in, gets blocked. Terrific play at two. I'm on again. No help. And he puts it up and in. And look who's the hero all of a sudden. In gear and driving in the worst. And Booth drives in, and sure enough, cuts that deficit back to three points. A two-possession game, you never know. Four-point play might rear its head. Here's McGee, puts it up. Knocks down a three! He wasted no time! Look at this. And Gillet of the Ostend fans, here comes McGee again. He puts it up from deep! And he misses, and Austin, incredibly, have held on in overtime. Of the Austin fans, here comes McGee again. He puts it up from deep, and he misses, and Austin, incredibly, have held on in overtime.